What's up everybody? Another episode of On Another Line here. Another fishing video, something you haven't seen much of me this year. Again, I've got a truck that's uh, <laughs> been in the shop for, for pretty much all summer. Um, so it's tough to pull a boat and do some fishing when you don't have a truck. But I borrowed a truck off my good buddy Brooke Williams, took his wife and Misty fishing in the springtime. And I actually forgot about having the footage until I was looking through my GoPro the other day and saw it. Caught a giant. Uh, big for this area um, you can see a lot of my videos come from Grayson Lake that's where this one's from too uh, happened I think this was uh, March around spring break of my school year there uh, actually it would have been April so without further ado guys uh, here's some footage from that from that trip we only caught a couple fish one of them being the big one I just about took a hook to the head saving me was the who rag uh, that I believe in and it actually just clipped the side of it which was a pretty cool deal uh, that's hap that's what happens in fishing especially if you're uh, fishing a lot of people on the boat or you're fishing up on the front of the deck like I you know Kyle and I do or Misty and I do a lot of times uh, that's just kind of the the thing about it but we had a good time the uh, gear that I used for this trip was a G Lumis NRX 894 jig worm rod uh, 17 pound test Sunline uh, FC Sniper. Um, I had it paired up with a black jig uh, from the Tackle Box in South Point, Ohio. 3 8 ounce, one of my favorite jigs to throw ever. And I had it uh, paired up with a black and blue, actually just a straight black net bait trailer. So here we go. Let's see what happens. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Heck yeah. It's a giant. 